Hey guys, I'm Otto Santana and we are here back in Lyon trying to find the miniature cinema museum. Come on, Ada, because she also wants to be part of my video. Yes, I, know. I want to be part and of the video. I was really thinking about one thing. If you come to a city that you don't know, what can you do? One really important thing you have to do is go to Google <laughs> and search, for example, things like best things to do in Lyon. In my case, I would search best free things to do in Lyon because I don't have <laughs> that much money for spend anywhere and after you do it it's really good to go to the instagram look the locations you're going to see the best pictures of the place i think by looking the best pictures you're going to know better the city and what you really want to do because at google you just find random touristic information but at instagram you know the real life from place i don't know it's because i like the pictures and i like to take pictures so i look at it anyway i think it's good for everyone you can see again we are in front of the fuvia cathedral one more we are at vix leon i don't know how to say it but it's where we are okay and mayara and her friend melissa is trying to find where we are because we are completely lost it's not a bad thing to be lost when you are in a city you've never been you are going to be lost, but just try it. Just go ask people where you want to be, where you have to go, because otherwise you, you're just going to be lost, and it's better to ask than be lost. <laughs> In this case, we are lost right now. Yeah, but we are searching, we are asking. <laughs> yes. That's right. the, what, what you have to do. Yes, that's what we have to do. Living in a bubble, bubble, so comfortable we cannot see the trouble. We are finally at the place we're supposed to be, at the Miniature Museum. And more than the Miniature Museum, it's also a really pretty place, so let's just come to see. Now we are finally at the museum, and what we find? The original double clothes of, of Spider-Man, I would say Omera, oh, because it's in Portuguese. And, like what the fuck? Why they have the original double clothes of Spider-Man? Like, it doesn't make sense at all. The original double clothes, like, so cool. Like, I always wanted to see the double clothes. Like, <laughs> we went downstairs and the surprise already started with perfume. Haha, <laughs> literally, because it was the set of the movie Perfume with the charter things, clothes and perfumes and even the perfume of the place had the smell of the movie it was just so nice but more than this we also had the view of the museum it's just so pretty and just so different from what I used to see if you don't like movies come anyway because it's really nice but after it we saw the mystic of Spider-Man the clothes of Fantastic Four, Hunger Games, there were so many real clothes of the real characters, it's so cool. I had a surprise because I saw Harry Potter, I saw Grinch that I love and I am him, I saw V for Verdita, I saw Chicken Run that was one of my favorite cartoons when I was a kid. But there's also other miniatures, okay? Now we are here in the Museum de Belles Arts of Lyon and more than the museum we also have this amazing and pretty garden so let's just come again i know i'm just showing the things but the things are more important than me right bubble bubble so comfortable we cannot see the trouble aren't you lonely up there in utopia when nothing will ever be you know look the back backstage of the picture of her <laughs> She's really famous here in, in France. Guys, look what I found right here. Egypt flip-flops. But they don't use Havaianas. They should use. Look. Now we are in my favorite part. A chronic following order of paintings. And in my head, it was paintings of a lesbian couple that suffered prejudice. And their family was against them. I don't know exactly but it was just so pretty and it just touched me in right deep inside my heart i don't know why but i know the museum is really rich with many things as for example all those pretty paintings you're seeing right now but i think it's just personal things touch uh, us touch you and that works that's how it happens i look all these paintings like this and i really imagine my mom uh, organizing everything and putting I'm going to put one in the up middle and one in the left and one in the right like 
but probably someone specialized on it, but I'm too dumb to understand the whole concept of art. So this is the end of the video. I hope you guys like museums and especially this museum that is the second biggest in France after Louvre. So if you like this, give a thumbs up, share and tell me what you think about this video and this kind of videos because your opinion is really important. Bye.